hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Michaela. thank you for joining video so in today's video i'm actually going to be showing you what i feed my babies in a day now i don't feed them the same thing every day i do different things different days so if you want to see what i do stay tuned so you guys can check it out So they start the day by drinking milk obviously I give them milk before anything else and they get up super early anyway so they drink milk first and then we have breakfast around 8 a.m. so today I got up late so I didn't make the egg fingers how I normally would but I'll show you guys um, the other ones I do in another video but today I'm gonna make egg fingers for them and you guys will see the ingredients as I go along it would be on the screen so yeah let's get into it so i'm gonna make egg fingers and i'm gonna make toast with butter on it so um when i did my research or whatever i realized that when you toast the bread um it's not as easy, as easy for them to take bigger bites so they kind of take smaller bites and then they you know chew because i mean babies are very smart so they would eventually just chew even if they don't have teeth they will still chew so i decided to give them some toast and they take a little bite they chew 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 chew, chew and then they would swallow it So after I mix the ingredients with the egg fingers, what I would do is line my Pyrex dish cover with parchment paper and I would throw the mixture into there. I would put it into the oven to bake for 15 minutes and then I would um, put the toast in the toaster, let it toast until it gets crispy enough or as I would think it's crispy enough and then um, I would butter it and I would cut up the egg fingers into slices and that's what you guys are going to see me doing in the video. So, so I just wanted to say not every day I give them strictly periods. I try to switch it up a bit. I try to interchange it and actually give them foods that they can try to eat so I can see like how they pick it up, how they grasp, how they chew. So I also do like chewing motions while I stand next to them because you can't leave them alone, not even for a minute in case 
they start choking whatever the case is so um i stand up right next to them and i watch them as they eat that's very important to not leave your baby because sometimes they can choke silently and you don't want your baby to choke so always stay right next to them so around um half 10 they have another bottle and they generally take a sleep around this time and then they would wake back up around 12 and that's when they would have a lunch now today i'm giving them sweet potato for lunch but because i'm giving them that i'm not giving them anything else with it because i know sweet potato can be um something that fills you really quickly but um today they actually wasn't in any mood for sweet potato i'm not sure but they didn't really eat it as much as they would on any other day but the thing with babies is you have to keep giving them stuff giving them stuff like the same thing over and over even if they it seemed like they don't like it you have to keep giving them it and after a while they would start taking it because they didn't like sweet potato one day then one day they would eat it same thing with yogurt because i generally give them this after lunch as you would see in the video and in the beginning they never liked it they would not eat it for anything and now they eat yogurt every day i give them a yogurt either after lunch or before dinner so you guys will see that as well in the video So for dinner, I don't give them any solids, um, I just give them either puree or I would give them porridge. Sometimes I make the porridge from scratch like I would use my own oats and blend it up with the oat flour and I would make porridge for them with that or sometimes I would use the gerber um, that you would see in the video here. Sometimes I use that as well so sometimes I interchange it because as I said not every day they like to eat the same thing. So. Um, I would give them whatever whatever I think about first on that day I would give them that and that's what I do and I also give them a biscuit today I gave them a biscuit after they ate the porridge because they didn't eat much and because their gum is scratching a lot these days so I just give them it some nibble on a little bit and they also eat it but it's good to help them with their feeling that they're going through right now so yeah that's what I did today
video guys if you guys would like more of these videos i probably do make it into a series so you guys can see what i do on different days so you guys can get some ideas if you would like don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video thanks for watching and if you stay to the end i appreciate it so much be sure to follow me on social media i'll put the link in the description and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys